In this tutorial clip we're going to look at painting a fantastic landscape in Kodu. We looked in the last clip at using the hand tool which is currently selected and using the left mouse button to drag the landscape around or the right mouse button to orbit. Um, we're going to move on now to have a look at painting a landscape with the brush tool here. And when I've clicked on this icon you can see we've got two additional kind of sub-menus that appear at the top. Um, the first is to choose and I can choose the, the arrow keys now is to you choose the colour of the terrain that we're going to paint. Just using the left button mouse button now to paint the wild and wacky terrain and go in one direction. And if I click I can use the arrows again to choose a different type of terrain. And let's make this one go in that direction. Left mouse button draws your landscape. Right mouse button deletes anything drawn. And if you notice up here, you can use the shift and control keys to paint or add material. Um, we can also, with the arrow keys, make the bones brush huge or very small for the finer details. And remembering that, I can use my mouse wheel um, and when I'm on the, I can press the space bar to orbit. Remember, if you've got a touchpad and a laptop, it may well be that your space bar to, to orbit is disabled. So that's my rather odd landscape at the moment, but just to show you a few more tools here on the brush, we can click on the right hand side and we can draw using the square brush, perhaps if I make a larger brush that will indicate it a little bit more clearly. So I've got a couple of strange looking square islands. Um, I can also use, escape by the way gets you back at any point, I can also use the round brush as the one that I was just demonstrating. The ones with the um, the lines in the background give you the opportunity to draw some kind of straight lines with your paths and a really neat one, and this is really useful for all sorts of things is something called the magic brush and this allows you to paint a whole selection so if I change the colour now so let's go to um, something a bit wacky let's go for this one and then my magic brush paints and fills it in with that chosen brush colour 